Hi fans of high quality entertainment, I'm just taking a sip of coke. Today, I am reviewing and ranking The Blue Mask by Lou Reed. So when this came out, let me think it over here for a second. Think it over. Song from his last album. Yeah, I loved it right away. My house. Women, underneath the bottle, the gun, the blue mask. And I found side two on the, the original vinyl a little less interesting, but I still, still loved it. So the album cover, of course, is a takeoff on Transformer, and it kind of matches what David Bowie did with The Next Day, that, that album cover. So he copied Lou Reed. It's, it's okay though, it's, you know, it's kind of cool in a way. I would give it a B minus is what I gave him. The production is stellar. I t I'm telling you, it's stellar. It's an A plus. My favorite songs are The Amazing, The Blue Mask. If you like Heavy Lou Reed, it's kind of like almost as heavy as The Velvet Underground Sister Ray. Almost. Not quite. <laughs> and not as long. But it is awesome. Great guitar. And Women is my second favorite. And Heavenly Arms. You know, Lou Reed is not the greatest singer, but sometimes he just, the way he does sing is just, I really think, I think he's a great singer sometimes, like on Heavenly Arms. Singing from the Soul. My least favorite song is The Heroine, but I still really like it. The lyrics are an A plus as usual, or mostly as usual. And I just wanted to mention the band on here. Robert Quinn and Fernando Saunders, and of course the drummer too, uh, Dwayne Perry. But Robert Quinn, awesome guitar work with Lou Reed, and Fernando Saunders, along with uh, Chris Squire of Yes and two or three other bassists, he is one of the best bass guitarists. I've ever heard. I love his sound, as, as do a lot of other people. Really, really nice. My overall ranking of this is a, is a B plus. And in my rankings, it goes between Transformer and Growing Up in Public at number seven. So I would love your thoughts on Lou Reed, The Blue Mask, in the comment section below. Yeah, I, I also just wanted to quickly mention that on Growing Up in Public, his vocals, compared to this, uh, on this one, like in some songs like Women and all that, it's softer, it's like he's not as angry as he had been on previous albums. I mean, except for maybe The Blue Mask. He sounds a bit angry there. But his vocals, a little bit more warmth than them on some songs. Great album. Love your thoughts in the comments section below on The Blue Mask. Thanks for watching. Bye.